Landmine Detection Robotic Vehicle with GPS Positioning using STM32. Landmines are explosive devices used in times of war and conflict to destroy enemy targets. Let us take a look at this landmine detection robot with GPS positioning using an STM32 controller. E-bike speed controller system using STM32 Fuel-based bikes are gradually being replaced by electric bikes since e-bikes are more eco-friendly. Let us look at this new system which controls the speed of an e-bike as per its throttle with the use of an STM32 controller. So the throttle acts like a potentiometer okay, which is the input of which is fed to the STM32 microcontroller and based on that the controller will operate the DC motor, the controller will increase the speed and as the speed increases and the wheel speed increases and we have a sensor here it is a ir based sensor which is used to measure the speed the measured speed is then displayed on the oled display using the stm32 controller so let's increase the throttle so we have increased it to the maximum and now let's decrease it gradually so as you can see as we decrease the throttle the speed keeps on decreasing until it reaches, reaches zero Collision Detection Robotic Vehicle Using Arm Most industrial activities are now performed by robotic vehicles, which helps automate and speed up operations. Let us check out this Collision Detection Robotic Vehicle, which detects obstacles and avoids collisions. Solar Power Measurement System using ARM Cortex Measuring solar power provides knowledge to make important decisions on future energy yield, efficiency, performance and maintenance. Let us check out the Solar Power Measurement System using ARM Cortex. So now I will remove this cover. As I am removing the cover, you can see that the voltage is increasing. The more the panel is exposed to the sun, the more it gets the voltage. Once I fully expose it to the sun, you can see that the voltage is maximum and the current flowing in the circuit is also maximum. Now what I will do is actually uh, pull the solar panel a little bit more closer because uh, the full capacity of the solar panel you can see after that. You can see that it's giving the maximum capacity that this solar panel can give which is uh, 12 volt and sometimes it also extends up to 30. Proportionately, the current also varies. So you can see the temperature is rising continuously. So this can be useful for the people who are monitoring. That is, if the temperature is increasing considerably, they can pull down the system so that it doesn't damage the entire system which is getting powered by the system. So this is how the project works. Thank you. Smart Digital School Bell with Timetable Display Despite the advent of technology, school bells are still the same old manual bells we remember from our childhood. Let us check out this smart digital school bell with the timetable display using an STM32 controller.
vehicle headlight, auto switching and intensity control. Smart cars have been upgraded several times, but the headlights have not undergone significant changes. Let us take a look at the smart vehicle headlight, which is controlled by STM32. This system automatically regulates the brightness of the light and turns it on and off depending on the lighting conditions outside. To start the system, firstly, we will need to turn on the ignition. Let us use a key to turn it on. By using our hands, let's stimulate darkness over the LDR sensor. If the lighting is below a certain threshold, the system starts the LED panel. The system continuously monitors the external lighting level and adjusts the intensity of the LED light. It dims or increases the brightness to achieve the desired illumination. Now, when we turn off the ignition, the controller waits for 5 minutes and automatically turns off the headlights to avoid battery drain. EV BMS with charge monitor and fire protection Electric vehicles surely are the future of transportation, but there have been multiple fire incidents with EV batteries, raising the spectre of safety and efficiency. Let us check out this EV battery management system powered by an STM32 controller. This system gives alert about battery status, charging parameters and temperature levels. This is a demonstration of EV BMS with charge monitoring and fire protection. The smart battery management system manages battery charging as well as it protects the battery. The system constantly monitors the battery voltage and charging or discharge current along with the battery temperature. The system has two types of charging, fast charging and slow charging. We now start with slow charging. The system charges the battery at a lower current in this mode. When we switch to fast charging option, the system charges the battery at a higher current for faster charging. Also, the system automatically switches off the charging as soon as the battery is fully charged to avoid any damage due to overcharging. Now let's discharge the battery by turning on the DC motor. We can now check the amount of current consumed by the motor too. Now let's simulate the battery overheats while charging or discharging. The temperature sensor detects the heating and instantly switches off charging or discharge of the battery using relays to avoid any damage or accident. This is how the system works. Thank you. Path Planner Robot for Indoor Positioning using RF Ranging the existing GPS network provides accuracy only within several meters. This makes navigation in robots impossible using GPS. By using the STM32 controller, this indoor mapping system can allow a robot to navigate its way accurately. switch for four load switching. Automation has made life easy, now everything is contactless. However, turning off the electricity load requires physical work. But with this new system, we can switch off the load without any contact by using STM32 controller. and pollution transmitter boy. Unlike land weather, sea weather is highly unpredictable and changes drastically at times. Let us check out the sea weather and pollution monitoring station that transmits data to shore-based stations. This system uses a range of sensors controlled by an STM32 to transmit the data.
Oh, 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 oh,